Well, bats are misunderstood mammals, often the stuff of myths and folklore. But these creatures of the night play an important role in our ecosystem. That's why there's alarm over a fatal infection sweeping through colonies in eastern North America. So far, it has killed millions of them. Ross Lord reports. This bat cave in southern New Brunswick used to be full of the tiny hibernating mammals. Not anymore. Typically there would be uh, 250 to maybe 300 bats in this cave. Um, at this point, this population in this cave is pretty much toast. Um, we found less than, we found about 20 bats in here today. Wiped out by something called white nose syndrome. A fungus first detected in New York in 2006, now sweeping through the bat population in Ontario, Quebec, and here in the Maritimes. It looks like a, a white fuzzy growth, uh, typically on the nose. The fungus spreads from bat to bat, preventing them from maintaining water and blood pressure levels. The afflicted are disturbed from their winter hibernation, craving nourishment. They emerge, have to emerge early looking for food, but the problem is that the insects that they would typically feed on aren't around at this time of year and they die of a combination of usually starvation and or hypothermia as well. The biggest uh, hit what bat species, the little brown bat, um, was once the most common bat in North America. Um, so now it's just being reduced. Millions of them have died. And researchers say the loss of these tiny flyers could have a big impact on humans. Fewer bats means less control over their main food source, insects. One potential result, farmers spending more on pesticides and in turn more chemicals in our food. There have been some, uh, some estimates done on the impact that the loss of bats will have on North American agriculture. It amounts to, uh, at, the, at the moment, the estimates are something like $3.7 billion a year. There are no obvious solutions, although the federal government is considering a request to have three of the hardest hit species of bats declared endangered. Ross Lord, Global News, Halifax.